the anesthesia department of pgi has developed a special instrument which will monitor the patient's movement what is this whole instrument let me take you across to professor jd puri uh, mr puri just wanted to know what is this whole instrument and how does it operate and works this is called closed loop anesthesia delivery system as the name suggests it controls the anesthetic drugs based on the feedback from the patient's conscious level heart rate as well as blood pressure level so based on the patient's weight height as well as uh, age and other characteristics which we have to enter into the machine before starting uh, anesthesia it calculates the amount of drug which is required for a target depth of anesthesia so depth of anesthesia is assessed from the eeg electrodes put on the patient's forehead so it controls the anesthetic drugs based on the initial estimation of the target drug and then minute to minute second to second it adjusts the rate of dr that uh, drug delivery based on the feedback of eeg blood pressure and heart rate uh, etc it has uh, another advantage that you can control the analgesia also like uh, fentanyl is the drug which is used to produce analgesia so the patient doesn't have pain then we use bicronium drug to control to produce muscle relaxation all these three drugs can be controlled the the uh, another feature of this is that if the blood pressure goes down because of the effect of these drugs on the patients especially in critically ill cardiac failure patient hepatic failure patient it will automatically increase the blood pressure by adding vasopressor drugs like noradrenaline dopamine dobutamine so it can alter the increase the blood pressure so that the patients other organs do not suffer because of lowering of the blood pressure so so in simple way uh, we can say that it will help to ease out the pressure which the anesthetic anesthesia the person have yes a uh, lot of these things require a uh, close monitoring as well as close attention of the anesthetist and uh, anesthetist in addition to controlling the anesthetic drugs also has to give blood fluid depending on the blood loss sometimes he has to do echocardiography so so many other things which he does it can distract from the main uh, 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 role of adjusting the drugs if you have this machine it will automatically control the drugs and if there is a drastic change in the blood pressure heart rate or any other vital sign it will give audio visual alarm as well as make alteration in the drug delivery uh, itself okay uh, can we say that this whole machine is indigenous yes it is indigenous and the uh, and totally made the the, the components have made in india like the monitor has been made in india syringe pumps have been made in india and the algorithm which controls the drugs is also made in india the advantage of machines in uh, in critical areas is that they work tirelessly 24 hours with the same expertise which you we have fed fortunately with the more and more data coming from each patient we are trying to use artificial intelligence to improve the uh, the system further okay uh, my last question is that is this machine uh, somehow trying to help the environment concerns also yes uh, environment concerns are helped by use of intravenous anesthetic drugs if you use inhalation anesthetic drugs they cause uh, uh, not only operation theater pollution harmful effect to the, uh, the, uh, the personals who are working in the ot at the same time when it is released into the atmosphere it causes greenhouse effect it causes you know ozone layer depletion global warming fortunately the intravenous anesthetics do not have any of these disadvantages so it is helping the uh, uh, environment pollution also okay so this is the uh, closed loop anesthesia uh, delivery system which has been made by the department uh, of anesthesia uh, in uh, pj chandigarh and professor gd puri has made this machine which will definitely ease that pressure out with video journalist grish durgapal this is lalit sharma for india today chandigarh